our channel. I've got 10 here. A little crazy today because it's super windy, but we are going to try out um, this bit by Sweet Billy Bits. It is a um, leather bit and it is a um, whatever the style bit is. I'll insert the name, but just a plain leather bit, super bendable. <laughs> He's back here. He's a little crazy first, so I'm gonna warm up in the bit that we normally do. And then um, I am going to, <laughs> I am going to uh, go ahead and flip it. And we're gonna do it without a nose band. So I'm trying to get my camera to work, but unfortunately it is not working today for some reason. So I may not get footage. I may have to have somebody try and film if somebody ends up coming out. Otherwise I'll have to try and get footage tomorrow. All right, let's try this. So Ten was very anxious and very um, just discombobulated in this bit. He was not listening to my seat or my aids. Um, he was hanging on my hands, um, trying to pull me down, which was making it really hard for us to um, get these bounce lines. Oh, that's quick. Okay, we are not okay with this. <laughs> I then switched back to his original bit and um, went through the lines again and he did a lot better. So this bit was a no-go for 10, but we're gonna try it on Theo next. So I actually really liked this bit on Theo. Um, he was very soft and he didn't flip his head up as much. Um, and the biggest difference here is his halt and back up. Whenever I would halt and back him up, he would throw his head up, stick his tongue out, and just in general get really pissed. Um, so this, well he's obviously throwing his head there because now he's getting all like anxious. but. Um, he really, really did well in this bit, and I have 
we've been practicing stopping, halting, backing up, and he always flips his head up and gets real irritated. Um, and in this bit, he halted and backed up really nicely without lifting his head. I wish I had a video of us halting and backing up before so you could see the crazy difference, but um, unfortunately I just don't feel like going through all my footage to try and find one. Um, but yeah, he's doing really good. Um, I'm just kind of getting him warmed up, um, taking him over the trot poles, trying to get him to stretch down long and low, um, trying to get him to move forward, and then halt and back up again. He is a lot stiffer going to the left. The left is his harder side, so he's a little bit more inconsistent um, in the bridle on this side and has a harder time um, wrapping around my leg. And so that's why we're just working a little, on little smaller circles just to kind of get him balanced.
So I realized they didn't film an outro or anything for this bit, but he did really, really good. He um, was listening to my seat. Um, we're doing some stretchy trot now to loosen up his back after our jump session. And I really liked this bit on him. seems to really like the the bit. Oh. <laughs> He's like, I'm done. I'm done. So he seemed to really like the bit. Um, he was very soft in it. He was responsive. Um, I just had him in a loose ring miler before this, um, level one, and he goes really well on this too. So I kind of like this because it's a little bit softer. He's not. Um, by far, by any means, a chewer, but um, he seemed to like it, huh, bud? Well, I think I might continue to keep using it, Ted. It was not a winner for, but oh, it was. You're fine. You like it? You like it? Good boy.